Like in the next five seconds or the scary clown will come after you. I will not risk it. What's good YouTube? It's your boy and cash money and we back with another video man. You see me getting up bored right there in the intro clip, bro. So now today what I got for you guys is some center gameplay slash tips. And this is how you play defense, get boards, and set hard screens for your guard as a center, bro. Like, bro, I'm going to give you guys the whole rundown. So, don't need to worry. First things first. If you are a non-shooting center, I think non-shooting centers had bigger bodies. But I don't know, man. I don't, I don't really know. But I'm just, I'm just saying, bro. I'm just saying so first thing first send you need to set screens like that bro how to set screens like that you need to be like on the side of the defender I know it's kind of obvious but no one does really does it all the time and the way to set bigger body screen you see me throwing a Stevie right there don't mind that but a way to set bigger bigger body screens is to use L2 now I am not perfect, I don't do it all the time, but the way to set bigger body screens, you gotta hold circle first to your defender, then hold L2. This will allow your player to get a big body animation. That way you set bigger body screens for your for your guard. That way it makes it makes our job easier, bro. It makes our job easier. Once they get score open, that's all that's all we really want. Now the second thing I know we centers don't do this all the time, but we also need to watch where to go when we go for the rebound. Now, what I mean is, we also need to be in position to grab a rebound, right? But also, we also need to be in the position to box out our defender. Like in this gameplay, I'm going to show you. I leave one pull up on us. No biggie. And we just dropped them off, bro. We just dropped them off. Me and my, me and my dude, we wasn't scared or nothing. So now, what I was saying is, you need to be in the position where you can get the board and box it your defender. Mainly box it your defender because this game requires more of a box out instead of rebound timing this year. So some people can automatically get the rebound you see like right there he wasn't gonna even he wasn't gonna even get to that point right there so i got my position for the rebound and i got it bro you see i even set the screen for the guard but how they're playing so high he went into the screen and caused my teammate to score easy two points so yeah bro it's just the little stuff our centers need to recognize you see how a guard plays he plays this look for the open shot and he looks for the score for our centers when we're going for a rebound we need to look for the center as well to get a good box up position and look where the ball is going for a rebound you see him throwing a alley-oop right there but the center didn't catch on because he's getting my pain beast bro telling you guys pain beast is a wonderful build bro in the beginning I recommend that you go with a glass lock if you're a non-shooting center. A pure glass lock because their rebounds are 99. And block. And interior defense. So that would be... That's a way better build. I'm telling you for non-shooting. But a pain beast is still good. If you really know how to use a pain beast, a pain beast is still good. And you see me getting the rebound right there. I should have pumped. I went to pump fake but they didn't let me. So now... Another way to set good screens too for your guard to use them very well is to set it in front of the guard. That way you, he can be very unpredictable. Once you set a screen in front of your guard, that means he can stab back, pull a three. You gotta know the type of guard you're playing with, bro. Just don't be running with randoms. Please don't be running with randoms. That would mess your record right up. I'm telling you. So guys, that's the tips I have for you. I hope you guys enjoy these tips. You can watch the rest of the game league to show to see that I'm living proof, bro. I'm living proof. You set a screen on the side of your defender good like that. Don't worry about the big man on them now. A guy's not gonna keep holding a big man like that. Once you have that good screen on the defender, you should be good to go. 
see that I was in position for a ball too. I didn't box out. It almost cost me, but I was in position for a ball too. Also, something you guys need to know is a way not to get illegal access of illegal screen. You see me getting the ball right there too, bro. I don't want to keep counting my boards, but I just I'm just showing you that I'm I'm in position for the board every time, almost every time. But another way to get non-illegal screens is to wait i know you sent us like the go and hurry up cut i know but what you need to do is wait until the defenders off the screen so I, I hope you guys enjoy this video like and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more amazing content it's been your boy i'm gas money and peace we out let's go we win let's fucking go